Hello everyone. Today we are going to see the apparatus for horizontal gel electrophoresis and how to set that apparatus. So here I will explain you the requirements or the apparatus which are there or the parts of agarose gel electrophoresis which is also known as horizontal gel electrophoresis. So here is a casting tray. Here is a gel detacher. Here are the combs for making the wells and here is a tank. Now how to do the setup? First whenever you are doing a setup for the gel you are supposed to seal it from the two sides. From two sides it is already sealed. From the remaining two open sides you have to seal it with the help of a cello tape, transparent cello tape in order to avoid the leakage of the gel. Now what will happen once you have sealed it you can pour the agarose gel into this casting tray. Now the gel will get polymerized. After polymerization you will remove the uh, and once you have poured the gel you will put the combs. The gel should be in the liquid state initially in that at that time um, that time only you are supposed to insert the combs. Now this comb has six wells, seven wells so seven wells will be formed and this has 10. So you will place these combs wherever required and after pouring the gel immediately you have to uh, place the combs. Once the gel get polymerized you will remove the combs. So first step is place the combs, pour the gel, remove the combs once the gel gets polymerized. The wells will be formed. Now what you will do? You will remove the gel with the help of a gel detacher or you can as it is place this tray and also you have to remove the cello tips. Remember that also. So you will keep that tray into this apparatus. Once it is done, you will fill this apparatus with the tank buffer here also and here also. So the gel should be immersed completely. It, so it should be submerged in the tank buffer. Once it is done, you are ready to go and you are ready to run your electrophoresis. But make sure that you add, you put on the electrodes like red to red, positive, black to black negative electrode on the desired voltage you will you will put the things on you will run the gen on the desired voltage like 50 100 150 and 200 and you will turn on the power supply so this is how the setup for agarose gel electrophoresis or horizontal gel electrophoresis looks like this thank you so much for watching